Hi guys, welcome to my kitchen. Today I'm making Southwestern Taco Mac and Cheese. Alright, I'm starting on a large scale. I have two pounds of ground beef that I ground up and I drained off the excess grease. Now I'm going to add in one onion I diced up. And I'm going to allow this saute over medium heat for a few minutes until that onion starts to soften up. Right, now they allowed my onion to saute in there for a few minutes and it's starting to soften up. I'm going to add in the equivalent of two cloves of garlic. I'm using a pre-diced stuff in the jar. If you use fresh, put it in with the onion. This is already pretty softened from soaking in that water. Alright, now I'm going to add in two packs of taco seasoning mix. Put that down in there. Let us stir and get that mixed. Alright, now I'm going to add in a 14 and a half ounce can of diced tomatoes, juice and all. And this is optional. I'm going to get that 7 ounce can of diced chilies, juice and all. Turn my heat down on low and cook this for a few minutes until the flavors all blend together. All right, now that my flavors all blended, I'm going to add in some cheese. I'm going to add in about a cup of mozzarella cheese. And I know you're saying mozzarella in a taco Mexican dish. Trust me, it'll work. I'm going to add in two cups of shredded cheddar cheese. And if you go a little over in the cheese, no worries there. More cheese, more better. Just going to give that a quick stir. And I'm going to add in some milk. I'm going to start with a cup and see how it looks. Now I have my heat set down on low. I might need to turn it up a little bit. Turn that up to about medium. I'm going to add a little more milk in because we want this nice and creamy. It's about a cup and a half of milk. And you'll be able to tell by the uh, consistency of it how much milk you want to put in it. Alright, now I have a pound of elbow macaroni I boiled up drain and set aside. I don't know that I'm going to get it all in there, but we'll put what we can in. You just want to stir your macaroni in. So this is probably, I would say, 10 or 11 ounces of elbow macaroni. If you use a big pot, you can get it all in. I'll just put that in the fridge in a little water. Maybe I can use it for something else. I'm going to stir this up guys, it's ready to go. Let's go ahead and fix up a plate and see what we got. I went ahead and garnished this with some green onion for some flavor and color. Let me get in here and try this guys. A bit of ground beef and some macaroni. So creamy and cheesy. You get a good taco flavor from the taco seasoning. The chili powder comes out. Get a little bit of heat from the green diced pepper. Guys, that was really easy. It's really delicious. Southwestern taco mac and cheese. Thanks for watching and supporting me. And remember, love what you eat and eat what you love.